Hello, this is day 27 of my 30 day death challenge in Valorant. Some days I play a match, I make some mistakes, and I play it back, try and learn from those mistakes. Alright, I'm playing with a five team of friends. Oh, it feels good. We've all been super busy with life, with kids, with cats, with work. Um, but we're back at it. This is still unrated, definitely a little frustrating. We're missing ranked a bit at times, but well, let's just see how it goes. So this is pistol round. Um, I've definitely realized how important pistol round is in terms of setting off the tone of the game right. And uh, it's hard because it's also when you're warming up, like you're just getting used to the game, you know, you're getting used to communicating again as a team. And so it's very easy to just run into it and not really give it as much thought as you probably should. Which to be honest, I think we probably did here. Um, but we're all at least pushing towards the same site, and we are, we're doing our best to coordinate. But there was not a lot of pre-planning here. You can see two of my teammates pushed through B long, so I'm coming in with Spike uh, through B long. I put out a couple smokes, and here's my, my very first mistake of the game. Trying to smoke off hookah, and I don't place it properly. It doesn't cover the window. I do a last minute adjust, but you'll see this comes back to, uh, to haunt me. Um, but I'm playing all right. Um, get, get three kills, and here it is. Boom! I realize, uh oh, like hookah window fully open. Well, maybe I'll get off the spec. Maybe we find. Nope. The Reina shows up. Perfect timing. Takes me out. Becomes a one v one. Our Reina versus their Reina. Forgot to reload before getting into that firefight, and goes down. All right, this is uh, day 27, death number two. All right, here I'm using a marshal, much to the um, frustration or aggravation of one of my teammates. I think both of us, two of us bought marshals on this sort of half buy round and uh, gets them kind of fired up and a bit angry, which I, I think is a reason why I might start playing marshal a little more just to kind of, to uh, you know, hassle his tassel a bit and have a laugh. I really enjoy the marshal, and the more I play with it, the more I like it. Um, here, Reyna, enemy Reyna here uses their Leer, and for whatever reason, I always just assume, like, there's only gonna be one of those. Like, you're not gonna use two of those around the same corner. But there, she uses one, it doesn't work out, or she doesn't peek. Then she does a second, and gets both of us on the peak. Ends up acing us, uh, as a team. What a bummer that is, huh? But, yeah, I guess you gotta know how many Leers she has. Thank goodness it's not one of those regen abilities, and she's limited to just the two. Alright, so here I TP into, um... Uh, heaven on A. Wasn't expecting to make it. I thought I'd see someone guarding heaven, but no one was there. So the TP worked. I end up on site. I let my teammates know. And I think there's one on U Hall. Yep, there we go. Uh, our cipher takes out their cipher, and site looks clear. So I put down the spike in what I hope is a decent, decent spot. And uh, I like getting up on these crates. Only a few of the uh, more mobile champions can get up in that corner. So I, people don't always expect it. I get down a few smokes to give us some cover. And here I'm kind of watching both showers and the uh, yeah, kind of the U-Haul area, I guess. There Reina pops out, not the cleanest kill, but I get it off. Here, still trying to figure out like where wall penetration is a thing or not. I realize I have to reload, so I start popping, popping down as I reload. Get in this gunfight, and it does not go well. So let's replay this. You can see what I am doing right here is bursting. So I'm doing, with the Vandal, I've realized the first two shots of a burst have almost no recoil. Um, but then the third shot has a very high vertical recoil relative to the first two. So let's see it again. You can see I do tap, tap, and I miss. I'm too far to the right. Tap, tap, miss. Tap, tap, miss. And then my third shot there, here's where I start to spray. And I do start to control my crosshair, bring it down, try and get some spray control, but it's just not working for me. So their breach does 156. I don't get off anything on them, and I go down. Our Reina takes a nap, and that's it. Alright. Well, you know. Oh, that's right. Hey, we won this one. What a good feeling that is when the spike ends up being the savior for the team. Actually, not a great feeling, but, it, you know, you win the round, and that's what matters. Alright, so, uh, here we go. This is death number four. I'm gonna be pushing into showers here. We play this a fair amount where we the team kind of splits and we both will fork off around one site, so two go mid, two go showers. Sometimes it works. Um, 
here our, our, our spike gets taken down in mid. And I realize that just about at this point and go, okay, well, I got to get back there and, and try and get to the spike before they have complete control over it. But here, I hear their Reyna coming around. So I decide to just post up and wait for her to come around. And she just out aims me. She comes in hard around this corner. So she's playing pretty wide, like far against that rear wall. So my crosshair is a little too low, not on her head. And she's sprinting in. But really nice control in terms of her, she, stop, she sprints in, then stops, crouches, and gets off a good kill on me. So you can see it once more. Again, crosshair a little slow, or a little low rather, and then I'm also a little bit slow following her as she, she really runs in. Not to mention, right, I'm still 120 millisecond ping, so, I mean, there's a few things working against me, but also my aim, and uh, not able to pull that one off. Yeah, I feel like a little rivalry develops between me and their, their Reyna. Um, more on that later. Alright, this is death number 5 for day 27. Okay, here we're pushing B again. And, uh, right, I TP into the uh, elbow area. Again, at this, con at this point it's kind of like a reconnaissance thing. I don't expect necessarily to get off the teleport, but it's nice when I do. I don't have the spike here, but I am hoping to maybe pinch them from behind. First I want to make sure that no one's on site, and then I do uh, kind of come in here and check is there anyone in the garden area or be long, they're not. Um, so I'm just kind of slowly going around the site. I do see the breach, and luckily able to get that off. And then I see the spikes down um, B mid, and so I'm going to try and go through hookah and connect up there. And uh, honestly I can't remember how good our vocal communication was between uh, Brimstone and I, but one advantage of teleporting back like this is we're, we're coming towards a spike from two different angles, right? So if someone's camping it, we kind of at least are trying to come from two sides. Their Viper's expecting me, takes me out, I only do 35, but luckily, right, the Brimstone has the other angle, able to get the Viper, and the Cypher for the clutch. Thank you, friendly Brimstone. Nice job. Alright, here we go. This is, uh, we're on defense now. Um, again, a half by round, so you know what that means. I brought my marshal back. Enjoying that quite a lot. Um, don't always get the kills there. I feel like that could have been a headshot, but it wasn't. But, uh, again, getting more confidence with the sniper rifles and enjoying them. Um, there it is. Get off that kill. Able to somehow avoid dying from their breach. Now this one, I'm quite proud of. So that's their Reyna there, she throws out her Leer, I stay chill, stay relaxed, I just make a slight crosshair adjustment, let her rip, ain't no thing. That felt good. Then there, there was that rivalry coming back at you, you know? Ooh, I bet she was feeling kind of a little, little sour after that one. Uh, we can hope. And then, uh, so it's 2v2, and um, right, we're defending, so we need to start pushing onto site. And again, we're kind of trying to pinch here a little bit. in the marshal and I'm comfortable with its no scope I've definitely kind of learned its accuracy limits there now why I had my knife out no clue that's mistake number one I got into the box had my knife out I also thought that my brimstone was playing a little more far forward so I was kind of imagining we'd really collapse in on that cipher instead it was I went too soon I had my knife out I died then he came in and also died so poor poor communication and what was I doing with my knife out there those were my mistakes. Alright, so this is uh, death number 7 already. Day 27. Alright, again, so we're on defense here. Um, we get the news that at least a couple are at A. You can see there, Reyna, who's their top fragger, is at A uh, and takes out our Brimstone. So I come in, and I'm playing pretty conservative here. And really, the rest of our teammates should be moving a little quicker to get over here. I still don't understand materials and wall penetration, but I do have some intuition there in that U-Haul. I know those bricks seem to not really stop bullets, so that's a good place I've realized to do some, some wall spray. Um, and I see the Cypher coming out here. Now I do want to review this, I don't often review good aim, but here I have a few shots lined up as potential headshots, and then I go into a crouch, and I feel like that's a great way to deal with, um, if you're going to start doing more bursts or more spray, get a few headshots off, then hit the crouch. And you don't even have to adjust your crosshair at all. Like, the crouch brings your crosshair down and lines you up for a little better uh, spray control. Now, here you can see we've got an arrow. The Viper was right there with the Cypher. She's expecting me. 
and so I should just stay in cover here. There's no reason for me to be peeking that, right? They're on attack, they're the ones who need to be pushing forward. Our Cypher has a really nice cross angle, but isn't able to pull it off, so. There you have it, that was death number seven. Now this is match point. Um, I mean, you can see, right? This final round, match point, we're not gonna win this. We're down, 6-12. Overall, I think it felt like a pretty, pretty close game. Um, close enough that it was still really fun for me. It wasn't one of those ones where you just totally beat out of the water, but but we were we were a little bit outclassed. Um, I think playing we play as a five group, and I think overall our average skill is quite low for a five group who's paired up. And so that I mean that's one of the reasons why we're really excited for rank is uh, we need to play against people who are as bad as we are. Uh, anyways, here we go. Um, spikes down on B. And someone showers, so I gotta gotta try taking them out, and then uh, trying to get over to spike on B pretty quickly. Uh, it's just me v2, and uh, yeah, I mean I shouldn't be playing this conservative, right? Like spike's about to go down. There it's planted. I gotta get there. Um, hit the trip wire, take it out. Uh, keep pushing, get a reload when I feel like it's still safe there. But yeah, and this is really a hard one for me. It's like, I each corner I slow down a little bit and try and make sure that I'm not going to get blasted. And then I start moving a little quicker and then I slow down. And I gotta, gotta learn that a little better. It's like, here I really, I should be running quicker. But I'm just, I'm, every corner I'm a little paranoid, a little scared. Happy with that. Good burst control. Able to get a headshot off again on my rival. And here's my last fail. Going through her stink cloud, and hey, what's that? There's a little tip of Viper's gun peeking out here from the left-hand side, and I should be checking that corner first. Instead, I'm gonna go in and check the uh, the box, so I just turn my back to her, and um, well, as they say, my ass is grass. The stink cloud gets me, and that's it. So that was a rough one. I think could totally could have had that. Granted, we're down by what seven, six, but. Hey, thanks for watching. Uh, another great match today. I really had a great time and uh, can't wait to play again. Uh, see you all soon. Bye.